Hey there, Angela Wills here from MarketersMojo.com and I want to show you another awesome feature of Audio Acrobat. I've talked about Audio Acrobat on my blog at Marketers Mojo. There's even a review there, but the review just doesn't get deep enough to really show you some of the awesome advantages of this program. This is really, you know, one of the, the best kept secrets on the internet This to use this program because it's going to save you so much time um, for audio and video. It can do so much and I know a lot of people don't even know, people who use this program don't even know all of the features. I love exploring features, finding out um, how to use everything that's within my reach. So that's why I love sharing that with you and hopefully showing you how you can use it to build your business and you know love your business even more than you do right now. So with that being said, what I want to show you today is the video. So let me click on video. Here I am logged into my own Audio Acrobat account. And what happens here is you ha can have videos that are saved and you can create a new video. So I'm going to show you a very specific feature right in here right now. I'm not going to do a whole tour or anything. I'm going to go to create new video. And I'll do a few more videos like this showing you all kinds of different features in here. So you can see, you know, for 20 bucks a month, it's really, oh, I forgot to click it. For 20 bucks a month, it's, it's just a fantastic program at, at, a, at a great price. I mean, for $20, just let me show you. Okay, so there's two options here. You can upload a video that you've already created, or you can go ahead and record with your webcam. So that's the, that's the feature I want to show you right now. And hopefully, I'll end up recording a video and I'll, I'll uh, do that while we're going through here. So let me click Video Web Recorder. Now, it needs me to allow access. So I'll just click Allow so it can detect my own webcam. Easy enough. It's just, it's just um, oh, it has already approved and detected my webcam. So it says click the begin button below to get started. Oh, here I am. So here I am doing this video and we're going to record another video. So I'll just kind of center myself and, uh, and click record. Now, so what I'm doing is recording a video within Audio Acrobat and then I can go ahead and, and, and enter the title. Um, I'll just put test recording here. And you can put a description. That's just kind of for your own use. Now what I'm going to use this for is, uh, you can use it for many different things, but one of the things I'm going to use it for today afterwards is to record some videos to invite joint venture partners. What I did was actually write a report about how I made $1,700 in one week with a virtual event. Now, the money came in in one week, but it was probably about 40, 45 hours of actual work on my part to set up the virtual event and to be there with the speakers. So for about 45 hours, something like that, I um, created this virtual event and made $1,700. Um, that's not the exact number. I'll have the exact number in the report. And so anyway, I'm, I wrote that report and now I want to contact all the speakers who attended that event and see if they would like to give it away to their list for free. And what I'm going to do is add a video and an audio component to that report. So it's going to be very valuable and something that I will probably sell on my site for $47 or $97. But what I want to do is contact some of those speakers and see if they would uh, give it to their list or post it on their blog for uh, free just an opt-in, so that way I can build my list. Um, and what I want to do is just send them a video explaining that, and it's going to be really easy. So let me stop the recording now. There we go. I stopped that, and this is length is 105 seconds, so about a minute and a half. And I just need to save it. So there we go. It's ready to transcode now. So that means it just needs to get, you know, um, ready to transcode. I'm not sure. That's what we don't need to know, you know, being 
uh, that we're using Audio Acrobat. We don't need to know those technical details. It does that behind the scene, and then once it's ready, it's going to show up in the video section. So it's going to take a little while because it's like a minute and a half video. So once it shows up here, I'll just go to this one, create a website with WordPress, since we are, um, we're just waiting. So what would, would happen is the video will show up, and what I'll do after I show you this is just um, pause the video, and then I'll come back once it is ready, and I can show you that it did show up. Um, so what you can do now is just publish the video. The, the video can be published in a number of ways. So let me just click. So we've got a, a bunch of tabs here across the top. I've also got down here another way to publish it, but I'm just going to click Publish Video. And you can publish for website, publish for email, publish campaign link. Now I don't even know what this is because I believe this one and the published social media are new. So now you can just tweet it, which is pretty darn cool, with a click. Um, and this is definitely new. I haven't seen it before. Um, and this campaign link, I'm not sure. I'm going to have to uh, check that out a little further. But let's say you want to publish it for email the way I just told you I would like to do, because I'm basically doing one video per person. So here we have, you can use um, HTML if you're sending out an HTML uh, video, which comes with you know a little audio acrobat click to play um, graphic. You can use an HTML text link. You can use just a plain text link, and this is the one I would use. You know, I'd, I'd send it out to each person. I'd say because I know each person pretty much. Um, you know, with a with a conversation style communication, I can just say, hey, you know, whoever. You know, I'm just gonna make up a name. Hey, Amanda, I made a video for you. I'd like to ask you something. Please check out the video, and I'll put the link there. A really simple email because I want their attention on the video. Okay, so that's it. I mean, that's how simple it is. I just created that video, and let me see. I'll go back in a second, see if it's ready. The video would have been created. I would go in here where it says publish. I copy that. I go to the email, and there you go. You have a personalized video that you don't have to, you know, um, shoot with a, a separate camera and then go in and edit, upload. Like, you know, there's no editing here. This is just going to be a simple video, something I can really throw up. If you want edited videos, Audio Acrobat does that too. And, you know, I just wanted to let you know, show you how easy and how one of the things you can use this for. There's so many different things you can use. Now, see, there it is, up already. Let me click. And so you can see this is a little grainy, and that's going to have to do with the quality of my webcam. And I can tell you that the one I have on my desktop computer is not high quality. But, you know, if this is for an individual person, that's okay. If I wanted a higher quality, I've got an HD video camera that I would record it from and then upload it. So um, how, what quality you want is going to depend. And so there you go. The video's there. And it's probably not going to play that well, so I'm not going to push play because I've got, you know, a lot of things taking up my um, CPU on, on my processing on the computer. So uh, what I'll do is just, you know, publish video like I showed you already. It's 1 minute and 44 seconds. There's so many things I could show you. There's stats. It shows, you know, how many times it's been played, all of these things. So when I do send it to someone, I can see if they played it or not. So I can, I can actually see if they viewed it. Um, but there you go. When you click Publish Video, I will use Publish for Email. I'm going to copy once I get all my videos done up. I'm going to copy, and then I'm going to send them an email. Simple as that. So if you do want to check out Audio Acrobat, my link, my affiliate link um, to, to go to is marketersmojo.audioacrobat.com. And I would certainly appreciate it if you do take my referral and you go there, check it out. You can even get a 30-day free trial. You don't have to pay a thing. Um, if you want some more details about what it's about, go to marketersmojo.com forward slash reviews. And you can check out the Audio Acrobat review that I created. And so there you go. Another great way to use Audio Acrobat in your business. Build your business. Um, connect with people. And, um, and use it for so many different things. Bye for now. This is Angela Wills from marketersmojo.com.